Welcome to Atlas. This is the tutorial on the login page of Atlas. So this is the main page where you would go to the atlas.biz and you would be able to log in through this page. You have, of course, your username and your pass in, password. And if you've forgotten your password, as long as your email is correct within the system, you can click on forgot password and it will send and will ask you for um, to reset and to send that password to you through that email. Um, you also have some information at the top here where if you wish you can go to a secure login and that takes you to whichever company you may be logged into and it will it will take you on to the secure login for that. Um, it's not necessary to use the secure login. Um, the reason that that exists is that if you wanted to open another window you could go to secure login and then you could click on the logo and you're already logged in. It's kind of a bypass if you will but you're still logged in under a username or password. You also have a link here of of what is Atlas and this brings up a PDF document that kind of details some of the things that we do and what direction that we're heading in as a company. You also have um, different re uh, pr printable permission list which gives you all the permissions for all of the employees that you're going to be setting up. This is one that you may want to print out so that you can have this where you can continue to look at and know what these different permissions are about. Remember that as we make changes within the system and we're constantly updating that, we continue to update this printable permission list with whatever new permissions or features or, or uh, benefits that we have through those new permissions. You also have some links up here for flyers and things like that. Um, the one I'm going to skip down to the search web inventory. This one is really important for a person that is using our system because if you go to the search web inventory, this is where every every company is able to have their inventory show up on the website it's part of the of the fee that you pay and at the top here we have a link that's called web developers if you click on this web developing this will take you through a series of different options that you have to make your inventory show up on your website so in other words if you put an item in inventory in your system then you can have that show up on your website automatically. It's real time. It shows up there as soon as you hit the submit button that inventory shows up there as well as photos, pricing, description, things of that nature. So this page here details how you can get that to show up on there and like I said there's three different ways. The first option is simply a button that you build on your website that says click here to view my inventory. The second, second option is what's known as a I window where it's actually embedded into the website so this one gets a little deeper this is getting into some developer code and most developers would know exactly what to do with this information and the third option is where you can actually strip off any of the information that you need out of there and that's right down here is where you get at the raw data so what we do is we web service this raw raw data to your website and then your developer catches it and shows it, displays it as you want it to be displayed. There is a link down here to a company that you can go and kind of look at the inventory. That's a play site where you can kind of show or see what is a result of that. And um, anytime that you have that set up, I'm going to go back to the main page again, but anytime you have that set up, you're able to have that inventory come onto the website right away. So back onto the main site here. Also down below, we have below these flyers, we also have a link here that's for merchant processing. And this details the merchant processing services that we provide, as well as it also has a referral page here where you can fill this referral page out. And this company, which is New Tech, whom we use a lot for processing because they have really good rates and they also provide a very very nice website for you to control all your merchant processing but you can fill this form out and then an associate will call you um, up from that company the other thing that we have on this is we also have where you can um, look at the different merchant accounts that we provide gateways to 
and we can tie into if you have your own merchant account you can we can tie into your merchant services through one of these accounts down here at the bottom also on the bottom of the main page we also have our tools and features and this is a little flash movie that runs that will show you some of the features we have or you can click on this features list and then this has additionally screenshots and all of the details that we offer so once again this has been a tutorial on the main login page for Atlas. So this is the atlas.biz page and we have links at the top here that are valuable. We also have a free online barcode generator that you can click on and you can create um, barcodes out of this. You can type anything that you wish in here and submit and it'll generate that barcode and you can print those barcodes. So that's a free barcode printer and also there is a profit and discount calculator there's a free finance loan calculator that will figure big payments like house payments all the way to the day. And then we also have a free financial flow calculator, which if you click on that, that helps you with your income statement side and your balance sheet side. And you can go in here and play around and add things in and it will throw you out of balance and you can figure out what your offsetting account is to be back in balance. So once again, that concludes our tutorial on the main login page. And thanks again for choosing Atlas.